everybody, this is Dr. Shear here, also from IDS in Cologne. We're giving a little tour here and a little preview of the iTero 5D. This is kind of the update to the Element Scanner, the Element 2. So iTero and Invisalign, or Align, has been quite busy lately with scanner development. It seems like every time I turn around, there's a brand new scanner. So what is the 5D bringing to the practice versus the other scanners? Uh, it's really about caries detection, which we've also seen from 3Shape here with the Trios 4. Uh, they're claiming uh, caries detection with an infrared system. I know it was released here at the Chicago Midwinter Meetings. Let's go ahead and put it to the test, see how it does. So this is our wand, very similar to the Element in Element 2. They're intending you to go ahead and put it in your hands like this, but you can tell it's a little bit kind of a heavier backside of it the processing materials must be back here. The tendency is to want to kind of grab it like this or to grab it like this and scan. They're also claiming you want to go ahead and see hold it like this. Side button right here to activate as well. So I'm going to go ahead and turn on the scan. Starting on the occlusal. So Itero, they claim they want you to be in contact with the tooth the whole time. But I'll kind of show you what the screen looks like. You can tell here it's still kind of like a red confocal laser with this kind of psychedelic little popping of the light. But I'm going to go back to scanning. Okay, one of the things about the iTero scanner too is it has a very intelligent computer algorithm. So let's see if it cleans this up. Got a little bit lost there on the palette. Let's go ahead and skip that and let's go straight to kind of a really complicated scan, which is a Denture 360. So we're going to go ahead and do a 360 scan of our denture with the iTero. Okay, so I gave it a go, and I think unfortunately I overheated the scanner. What I do have here, in fairness for the iTero 5D, which is a very impressive scanner, I was able to scan an earlier scan 360 degrees completely all the way around. Computer algorithms allow us to do that, but there was a little bit of a challenge there. I was supposed to leave this kind of air vent exposed. I probably had it with my hand, might have overheated the scanner, but hence why we're probably supposed to hold that way. Very good. All right, everybody. This is Dr. Shear looking at the new iTero Element 5D. Let's go check out some other scanners.